Well, let's find out. On the bright side, if we fail this, we should still get into... Well, we've already fulfilled Flyby Jewel. We should still get into Orbit Around Jewel. So that's good. Okay, here we go. And that's... Uh, so, I mean, uh, we, we'll be able to transfer to Val and all. Even if uh, we don't get captured. So it's probably better that we're high. Yeah, I, oh, I know I can drop the heat shield and burn. That's not the problem. The problem is the Delta V we have left, sign versus cosine. Yeah, uh, yeah, we can drop the heat shield, but we don't have too much Delta V in here. I'm hoping that this can bring them back home, which is a tough call. Okay. Calm approach to Lathe with Jewel in the background. Okay. Dark side, unfortunately. But we've got ambient light adjustment. That's why we have it. Okay, but oh, I hope this thing doesn't flip around. Oh, I'm gonna try my best to keep it from doing that, but wow. I can already tell. I'm suspicious it's really gonna do that. Oh boy. Don't flip, don't flip. You can see my yaw and pitch right now. Uh, 7 G's. Come on. Okay, G-Force is going down, but it's still very hard to hold it steady. Maxing out my controls here. We are in orbit. Plus side, we haven't flipped around and we are going up. Okay, keep thinking positive vertical speed, little guy now. Come on. I can't check the... well, I guess I can check the map. Hold on. Uh, we're getting a little bit tight here. Oh crud. Oh crud, oh crud, oh crud. Um We have to we have to flip around now. Oh no. Come on, flip me around, flip me around. Oh jeez. Uh how do we Uh oh. Oh no. Uh I'm dropping the heat shield. Come on, flip. Darn you, flip. Okay. We're going down. Lathe hates me, I swear. Lathe has been the center of all our problems. I should never have done this. Um. Oh, whoa, what was that? Oh, that was the heat shield, probably. Maybe. Oh, or the fairing. No, not retrograde. Come on. Come on, flip. You flip every other thing, this game. Every time I do want to do something, you flip me around. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, hold on. I've got an idea. We're going to force this issue. Yep, yep, yep. No, come on. Come on. My joystick is going to break at this rate. Mm. 
we have parachutes. That's one thing going for us. But I want to get this into orbit. And then we're going to have to do a rescue mission. Come on. You know the direction I want to go in. No, 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 no. Come on. That ways. Ah, come on. Yep, no. What the heck does this look like? We don't have much time here. Well, these tourists are sure getting their money's worth. <laughs> you quite enjoyed watching that. There weren't a, there weren't enough explosions to start chaos. Now 36 kilometers is too low for that approach. But uh, if you're on a slower transfer to Jewel, I was on a somewhat quicker transfer to Jewel. And of course, going between the different moons of Jewel will be different. They look rather passive. Yeah, they're crazy. The, the tourists are crazy. Okay, let's get... Flatten out here. We're pretty much out of fuel after this. Oh, if we even make it. Hold on. Uh, we are aborting the whole attempting to land thing. So, bye-bye. Uh, do we have any resources up here that we should get? No? We've got a docking port here. All our Kerbals are in this pod. Okay. Away you go. Uh, no, no, I don't want to focus on that. Okay. That'll save us some uh, potential hazard. Failing is enough in this case. Okay, thanks. Thanks a lot. Now, if I mount a rescue mission, I have to remember they're going retrograde. Oh, there's a tiny bit of fuel, yeah. I should have transferred it, you're right. I panicked. No, there's just a little bit of fuel. There's uh, 27 liquid fuel and 33 oxidizer. I should have transferred that, yep. Uh, and I should have dumped this monopropellant too while we're at it. Don't need that. This thing doesn't have RCS ports. Okay, let's begin burning for orbit here. It's futile! It's futile! Oh, man. Great. Yep, I should have transferred that extra fuel, but even that, I don't know if it's gonna be enough. <laughs> this is gonna suck. Um, well, there's very little left for us to do. Make them EVA to orbit? I don't think they have enough Delta V. Well, I, that, that's 
weird anyway. Alright, well, they've got parachutes. They've got their things. No EVA option for just tourists? Well, I'm not gonna try anyway. Alright, jettisoning the service module. Yep. They don't have much electric charge either. Looks like they'll hit land? Well, it depends. I don't know the rotational velocity of Leif. This is a possibility. Well, the e uh, the EVA option is blacked out. It's uh, it's darker here. Uh oh. Come on, don't do this. Yeah, it, it looks like the EVA option is not an option. Is it possible to rescue them in water? It looks like we're going to have to figure something out for that. This is gonna be complicated. We didn't even get orbit around Lathe. Darn it. We were sort of in orbit around Lathe briefly. Have to make it a stable orbit. Launch off Lathe is a tall order on land. Needs to be a heck of a ship. Sounds like a job for a space plane, honestly. Lathe has a uh, breathable atmosphere, right? You can just use a space plane. They can't even land on the surface. Ah, uh, EVA on the surface. I've never tried, but uh, let's. Well, we'll find out pretty soon. I don't think I've ever landed Kerbals on the surface of Lathe. They're, they're just fine. I told you they're crazy. Yeah, we can dock and transfer. We need a VTOL airplane, I think, is what we need. And then uh, maybe with a docking port somewhere on it. But claw will probably be easier. It'd be easier with the claw. Why don't I have any ablator? Either A, it, it probably burned off uh, during the initial re-entry around Lathe. Uh, for some reason, even if it's within a fairing, it uh, it burns off when it's when the whole thing is heated up. Yeah, now they're a little bit well. Kerberry seems fine. The island seems fine. It's Stelsi who uh, who knows. Maybe she did her research. After all, she was the one that wanted to orbit around Lathe. Okay, I think uh, we're approaching parachute time. Let's go for parachutes. Yeah, can we transfer via the claw? I don't know. I haven't tried transferring Kerbals through the claw. Does anybody know? I'm not usually in this position. This is a remarkably badly thought out mission in retrospect. I'm not usually this careless. At least I'm on land and I can save them. Yeah. Hopefully that'll make it easier. Well, it looks like they'll have a okay landing speed. You don't believe we can, but you look it up. Please do. Well, now they're all thrilled. This is really weird. None of them wanted to land on Lathe. Yep, it's flat enough to land a space plane. Yep, whoa, Jewel. Hold on. Tourists may not disembark from the vessel. Okay, well, we've got that part. So, here they are. 
Let's go back to the Space Center. What can I say? This is going to be a tough, tough mission to get them back. How long does the tourist contract even last? Hey, what's happened? Hey, uh, that's a good question. What happens to the tourists if the contract runs out? I mean, we've got this contract. We've got 35 years to fulfill it. What happens to them if the 35 years is up? Does anybody know? Has anybody had one of these? Has anybody sent out the tourist? Had the contract expire? What happens to them? Anyway, uh, it. Uh, I wanted to see what our situation is altogether. So, vehicle assembly building, a fully upgraded, launch pad fully upgraded, uh, our tracking station has another level, our space plane hangar needs an upgrade, runway needs an upgrade, mission control needs an upgrade, astronaut complex needs an upgrade, admin building, we haven't even upgraded it once yet. R&D needs an upgrade. Let's get some uh, calmer music now. Let's go back to the top. Because I need to ponder this and that requires pensive music. We don't have any addition. We can't unlock anything right now, but this is our tech tree right now. So we've got a nuke. I guess a nuclear tug is something that we should contemplate at this point. You'd imagine that they that I just failed the contract, but they're still there. Well, I guess that's that's the assumption we have to go by. You can transfer fuel with the claw, but not crew. That's gonna make it a lot more difficult. Yep. Well, we we're gonna need to do this in steps. See you, Dark Chaos. First, I'm going to make a variant of the... of the tug that I had in the Sandbox CDB series. I need money and tech to finance a robust rescue mission. Yeah, you're right. We're a little bit on the downside on the money. Let me just finish building this first and then uh, we'll consider that situation. What happened? What happened is we have three tourists stranded on the surface of Lathe because we airbrake too sharply. So that is what has happened, Husky. Now I have to think about how the heck to rescue three tourists from the surface of Lathe. And uh, we don't have the money for it right now, frankly. Can tip the CM over with reaction wheels. Rover it over to dock, transfer crew and undock. I don't know, can we tip the CM over with the reaction wheels? I don't know if we can tip it over. Maybe. We'll have to try that. Oh jeez. I seem to be a little bit out of it right now. This has been a drastic failure and my morale is low. Read the comment before that, you were suggesting a space plane that can be used as a rover once I land. Oh, okay. Still need to tip it over though. I'm not feeling this. I need a quad coupler, not a three-way coupler. For this. Uh, maybe some other arrangement is better. Okay, let me not think about this. I need a contract to get some cash. Yeah, I know the inside tank was tilted. It was not going the way I wanted to. Nope, well, it's not going the way I wanted to. Why would tourists want to go to Lathe? So many beautiful things back in Kerbin. Don't ask me, I'm not much of a traveler myself. Rescue Chadson Kerman from orbit of Jewel. That sounds dangerous as all heck. Return to Kerman from a flyby of Val. 
We got Val stuff. We got Moho stuff, which is even worse. A facility on Moho. Outpost on the surface of Moho. That'll cost a heck of a lot. Satellite contract is boring. Really, rescue a Kerbal from orbit around Kerbin. Uh, let's see if we can get better stuff. Huh. Still get those. Probe to Drez? Well, we've got the Explore Drez contract. Have to land on Drez and uh, transmit data. Rescue from Jewel Orbit, two birds with one stone. Yeah, but I, the Delta V to get into wherever this Kerbal is, I don't know where this Kerbal is. Let's see if we, I don't know if they outline the Kerbals like that. You know, sometimes on the contracts they show you where the satellite is. But I don't think they got to show me where the Kerbal's going to be. Oh, well, that's a satellite. That's not the Kerbal. I think the Val stuff should be straightforward. And uh, a probe around Jewel could carry some fuel with it. But then maybe we should make it small as possible and get the funds. I think we need to rack up funds rather than try to spend funds. We could do this and the uh, Chadson Kerman one. Yeah, let's position us. No, I don't know. It could be. This is very far out, though. Well, I might as well take this uh, science data from surface address since I'm gonna do that anyway. I'm afraid of the Moho stuff. We don't have ion engines yet. But this is a very heavy thing. Cupola, eight Kerbals, wheels crazy okay so uh, the question is which transfer do we get first we've got a Drez thing and a jewel thing to do so uh, Drez is what 82 degrees and then jewel is 96 degrees no neither contract needs to be returned it just needs to transmit data it looks like we're uh, right on the transfer time for Drez let me get my protractor out to verify. Uh, we're actually a little bit late. We're like at uh, 78 degrees instead of 82. Okay, so uh, we should do the Dres mission.